Hello guys and welcome to the race 2 of the TireRack.com truck series here from Atlanta for the Great Clips 200 where we'll go 20 laps and see who will win. I'm Daniel Hummel and as you can tell I kicked Brian out of the booth. He's up doing the cup race for Atlanta. Anyway, Corey Williams will start on the pole and Sam Curtis will start next to him and here is the rest of your starting lineup. And after that, we're going to take you to the green. Pace truck coming out of turn three. And Corey Williams set to lead him to the green. Griffin Lynn, your winner at Daytona, looking to make it a two-peat and clinch his spot in the chase. Anyway, Pace Truck pulls off, and the race for Atlanta is green. Good start by Corey Williams as he clears the outside. Chris Dodds marching on the inside. Here he comes to the, to the inside. The 11 of Joseph Curtis now going to the inside. He's going to try and make a move. Now help with Marcus Wish. He's going to go to the inside, make a run down the back stretch with help from Zach Buchanan. Three wide behind them. And here goes Zach Buchanan for the lead. Griffin Lynn right behind him. But she's not gonna he's not gonna make a move. The front has sort of settled out right now. Here goes Griffin Lindsay inside. And he will have it going into turn three. But will he clear him? No, he won't. It's going to be close. Griffin Lind had it in the line, I believe. Yes, he, yes, he did. Three wide for lead. Marcus Wish and Zach Buchanan on the outside. Zach just tucks back and inside. Marcus Wish clears him. Three wide for second now. Zach Buchanan just stuck on that outside. Can't make a run. Now here goes. The one of Cole Vaughn to the lead. With help from the with help from the fifty of Rosa Feliciano da Silva. Never mind, she just ditched him. Now Zach Buchanan back to that inside line. It's not like Daytona, where if you go on the outside, you drop all the way back. It's definitely not like Daytona. Marcus Wish just chugging away in that lead. Closing in on halfway here in Atlanta. 
Marcus Wish is chugging away. But here comes Zach Buchanan on that inside line. He's going to make a run down the back stretch. And he's going to take it going to turn three. With, a help from, with help from the six of Drew Carson. And now Carson's going to go to the inside. But I don't think he's going to have enough momentum. And Zach Buchanan leads the lap. And Marcus Wish tucks them down behind them. But here comes Drew Carson with help from the 50 again. Rosa Feliciano da Silva. And I believe they're pitting. Yes, they are. Here come the leaders down pit road. And the only one to stay out, Sam Curtis. And he will get a bonus point for leading the lap. will I believe be one of maybe two pit stops we'll see how it all plays out it looks like Zach Buchanan's gonna lead him off pit road he will Drew Carson right behind him I think Sam Curtis is just trying to maybe secure, maybe make it to the end on one stop, which is which is gonna be close. I think Zach might be able to make it to the end, but he might not think so. But a sizable lead coming up for Zach. And Drew. So top two have just pulled away. Good pit strategy for those two trucks. And here goes Drew Carson trying to make a move. And he will have it going down to turn one. Wait a second, he might not. Yes, he will. As these two are double file, third place is catching up to him and fast. Now the 28's caught him. That's Alpa Wanderley. Drew Carson leads him. Here goes El Elbow Wander leading the inside with help from Feliciano da Silva, I believe that was. Yes, it is. Griffin Lynn back up in the top five. Seven laps to go in Atlanta, and people are in the top five is pulled away from the rest of the field. Drew Carson's the lead. Rosalina, or Rosa, sorry. Rosa Feliciano da Silva helping. Three wide, they're looking to go. There's three wide and a three. That pans out well. And Feliciano da Silva back trying to take the lead from Drew Carson. They could just stay single file. They could probably get even farther away from sixth place. Look out! Griffin Lynn almost got turned there by Elba Wanderley. And here goes Zach Buchanan to the inside of De Silva. And he's going to take the lead going down in the one. Maybe. 
That outside line is really actually pretty strong today. I don't know how, but here comes Griffin Lynn to the inside. A little help from Alba Wanderley. And Drew Carson is just falling back. I believe that was Griffin Lynn leading that lap. No, it was Zach Buchanan. Three laps to go coming to the line. Who will win in Atlanta? Or will they have to pit? Three to go. And we still have a side-by-side -side battle here between Griffin Lynn and Zach Buchanan. And now here comes Rosa Feliciano Silva trying to come into the mix with Elba Wanderley. She's going to make a move to the inside. Never mind. And Griffin Lynn is pulling away. Two to go. Griffin Lynn pulling away down to turn one. Zach Buchanan trying to close in. And he is closing in fast. Throws the block on Alba Wanderley. He's going to go to the inside. Can't get there fast enough. I believe... Are they pinning? Here come the leaders on pit road. Will anyone follow them? Yes, everyone's coming on pit road. No! Sam Curtis stays out. He will take the white flag. Sam Curtis, that was excellent strategy by him. Will he come in this time? Or? Sam Curtis. He will not come to pit road. Sam Curtis is going to win at Atlanta on excellent fuel strategy. And he will take the checkers. Congratulations to Sam Curtis, winner of the Great Clips 200. On what I'm surprised again was a caution-free race. And who will take second? It looks like it will be Griffin Lynn taking second place. Rosa Feliciano will sell a third. Colvon fourth and Zach Buchanan fifth, Drew Carson sixth, and we are still waiting for results to become official. I believe they might be official now. If Sam Curtis gets the victory, a well-needed victory for him. As it may just help him out in the chase. Yup, the standings are now official. Anyway, Sam Curtis first. Griffin Lynn second. Rosa Feliciano to second third. Cole Vaughn fourth. Zach Buchanan fifth. Drew Carson sixth. Dylan Young seventh. Courtney Miller eighth. Marcus Wish ninth. And Chris Dodd tenth. And here are the rest of your results. Anyway, I want to thank you for watching. Our next race is at, at Martinsville, but stay tuned here for the Straight Talk series right here from Atlanta. Thank you again, and goodbye. And here are your standings.